Hello, Han, uh, Alec, Han, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Uh, I'm great. Uh, we, I was introducing you about uh, that you are the CEO of Bitcoin42. Can you tell us a little bit about uh, Bitcoin42? Yeah, well, I, yeah, I represent Bitcoin42 and it's, uh, it's uh, my birth child, so like from the idea and the concept and um, Yeah, well, um, it started originally in 2010 uh, when I got first interested in Bitcoin. And then last year I thought, well, I have to take this to another level. Uh, back, I was already mining, um, exchanging uh, my parents' business. I introduced uh, uh, people to uh, accept Bitcoin. The first uh, tennis center in the world <laughs> where you could uh, pay your tennis uh, lessons and your tennis uh, Uh, hours in a uh, Bitcoin and um, yeah so last year we decided to uh, to deploy some ADMs first uh, I'm from Germany so we were thinking about doing it in Berlin but uh, we are also uh, organizing a, a big which is actually it's opening today uh, a big uh, film festival a film and gender film festival Okay, and that's why we were in Tijuana, and I said like, okay, well, you know, let's, let's do it here. Uh, that's why you have like a lot of people here. We're organizing everything. So uh, yeah, so we started. We said in December. No, in uh, when did we say? Yeah, well, December kind of things got serious. We looked different companies, and uh, we decided to go for um, a Genesis coin. Um, and uh, the CEO, uh, even Rose, a very cool guy, very helpful, uh, very professional and uh, very good, uh, solid equipment. And um, yeah, we purchased two of his ADMs. Um, one of them was, uh, it's a US dollar unit. You, you, it, it, uh, you can put in dollars and get out dollars. And the other one is a pesos unit. So you can, uh, you can buy and sell Bitcoins, but you also can uh, buy Dodge coins and Litecoins. Okay, it is great. Uh, the news for us is that in Tijuana you have the first Bitcoin ATM in Mexico. I think in LATAM also. Yeah, uh, there is in Brazil, there is a, a Lamasu. It's a, it's, a, it's a very popular ADM brand, but uh, with this one you only can buy Bitcoin. Ours is special because you can also sell bitcoins and it's even more special because it's the first in the world where you can also buy Litecoin and Dogecoin. And how does it work? Uh, do you go with your dollars or your pesos and insert them on the ATM and get bitcoins to your cell phone? Exactly. Like, uh, Uh, there, there are two different ways. Um, uh, it's, it's very, very straightforward. I mean, people know how to use an ATM. It's probably easier than that. You go, you go and you say, okay, I want to buy Bitcoins. You push a button and then it tells you, okay, uh, I need your address. Where, where, where do the Bitcoins go? So you can either with your phone. Uh, let me see if I have my, how it shows you. Let me see. So you can either go with your phone and uh, scan the, uh, the QR code. Um, um, which has the, the, the address, or you print out a paper wallet. So basically it prints out a piece of paper with, uh, with the code on it and, and also the private keys. And it's like your, you know, like your email address and your password. And with that, you can redeem, you, you can send the wall, the, the bitcoins to this piece of paper. And, um, yeah, and it, it's amazing. You you have it just on that piece of paper and you have to take care. So this is like a, a QR code. Let me see okay. if you can see that. So you can you can scan that at the ADM and here is your this is basically your as uh, a bit over. Let me see if I can make down the intensity here. Ah oh, that's better, right? So you, you see there this is the public key. It's basically your account number. And um, and yeah, so um, and, and then you 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 put in the dollars or the pesos and the, and it get instantly uh, it gets funded. And, um, and a very cool function is also that um, if you sell a Bitcoin to the machine, you can, you can make a, a sell request, a withdrawal request, 
And it's, the ATM shows you the address. It tells you, okay, please, uh, you know, send me uh, to this address uh, the bitcoins. And you say, okay, I want to have uh, you know, uh, 500 pesos or 50, 50 US dollars. So he, he takes the mass of the, of the current uh, exchange rate. Uh, he tells, okay, send me this amount to this address. And you can have someone anywhere in the world, you send him that address, he makes, he fund, he sends the Bitcoin to that address and you, you redeem it instantly out. So we, we are exchanges, but uh, practically you could make uh, within less than a minute a worldwide transaction to almost zero transaction fees. <laughs> that's, that's great. That's a geniality of the Bitcoin, how it is built. And uh, the ATM is a more tangible way to see the Bitcoin because you can uh, exchange it for real money. But oh, of uh, course, yeah, fiat, fiat money, yeah. And what are the plans uh, for Bitcoin? Or in Tijuana, is there any stores accepting the Bitcoins, or do you need to have more ATMs in the country? How's the road for Bitcoin for you? <laughs> Okay, so Bitcoin 42 is, uh, we are inspired by the, the social banking network, um, and the social banking institute, and as well as the economy for the commonwealth. So um, what our, our aim is, is to, uh, uh, we make a commitment. We say, we say we'll, from day one, we will give 10% of our um, profits to uh, non-profit organizations here in Tijuana and wherever our plan is we want to have at least 42 other ADMs in the world Latin America and Mexico also San Diego soon California and um, and each time we have a new new city uh, we will raise it by one percent until we reach 42 percent and we know it's possible we know other companies uh, which are not in the mainstream but they they even give 50 percent of all their Profits and they can still make a good living. So I think it's totally possible, and uh, I'm very happy to do this. Um, and uh, and the plan is yes. So the plan is uh, we want to definitely expand as a startup business uh, here in Tijuana, but also in Mexico, uh, also California. And um, obviously, okay. So your question uh, about acceptance of Bitcoin right now in uh, in Mexico. Is, uh, is few. Uh, in De Jefe, there is more. Uh, here, it's is, is very sparse. Um, although, um, there is um, a company called Pare Mobile, and they have a way you can send uh, value with short messages. Something we are going to introduce also very soon, but you will not need a contract with any phone company. Um, and, um, well, and they offer a service that you can, you can top up or link your, your your mobile phone account with a Coinbase account, uh, where you can have it's like a, a provider for bitcoins in the US, and it's a bit it's like uh, a little bit uh, complicated like not complicated but it's like you know it's not direct using bitcoin it's indirectly but you can basically uh, have uh, pay with this mo party mobile thing in a 7-Eleven anywhere um, other places too. Uh, also, there is an exchange uh, called CoinCove where you can uh, also buy Bitcoins very easily uh, within uh, a day or two. Um, but uh, obviously, the the ATM it's it's really giving it a face, giving bring it into reality. People so people can really um, better comprehend and understand. And we are going to educate. At the 8th of April, we are having a press conference. We'll also make a, a workshop explaining the public. Uh, how these things work and uh, yeah it's a, a part of our mission is also to just be educators because with bitcoin everyone becomes their own bank basically you are giving the master tools into the hands of the wider population and finally uh, i think the bitcoin it's the first generation of these new currencies in the world but it can be improved how yes. or what do you think it could be improved on the Bitcoin? 
Um, well, there are already many improvements. Uh, there is a peer coin which uh, says they are more sustainable yeah. since they need less hashing power to maintain the, the, the network security. There are light coins. There are there's this, uh, there's even um, uh, it's something called uh, Eurythium. Uh, that one is it's uh, I think these people are already like five or ten years in the future. <laughs> they they basically use the peer to peer proof of work uh, Bitcoin concept. Uh, but you can basically introduce codes and coding and execute uh, uh, programs and it's like a complete new way how to. Uh, create applications, make contracts. Uh, it's it's this this one is is totally mind blowing. So there is extremely extremely uh, creative uh, solutions and and advancements already after you know five years uh, you know of, or, of Bitcoin. So it's it's really amazing, and I I see it as a, um, a just an evolutionary step. Uh, you know, we say like a revolution, an evolution. Um, of uh, the monetary system, and uh, I think just this morning I read some bank uh, CEO said uh, for banks they either have to adapt or, 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 or yeah, <laughs> uh, what did he say? Let me see, I want to get the correct wording, <laughs> mm -hmm. but um, yeah, it's, 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 it's unavoidable basically, you know. Great, well, uh, this is Alec Han, uh, CEO of Bitcoin 42. Why 42? Yeah. Is it the answer for anything, for everything? Yeah, I, it's a reference to the to the book of uh, Douglas Adams, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Uh, but as I said, our our it, it represents our main goal. We want to um, we really want to good, make a good impact uh, on uh, the local economy, the global economy, and uh, and really to benefit and uh, help the people. So we, we put uh, we put that in place and want to reach 42% of donations, uh, which uh, people will be able to choose themselves when they use the ADM. They will be able to say, okay, I want to have that uh, whatever transaction fees are, are done and, um, and not transaction fees, sorry, exchange fees um, are done, uh, that they will be donated to food and shelter or education or culture. So uh, we take this very serious and uh, yeah, the, we, we are here, here in Tijuana, in the Bit Center, uh, ready for action. Great. Thank you very much, Alec. I, I hope to hear from you very soon. Yes, thank you. Thank you also for the interview. Have a great, great day. Cool.